Hey everybody, this is Will with AppMatic.net, and today I'm kind of doing a re-review of this case. Um, I actually had a couple of requests as well to see it more by itself compared to the other ones. This is the uh, Chinao Wheat case. Now it is a leather case, but kind of described by the color. It is quite a unique looking case for the iPad 2, and uh, after a few more days with it, I'm actually really, really liking it. Now this is by Chinao. So as I've said in previous Chinawa video reviews, their quality is outstanding and in most cases is quite above the rest in terms of you know the leather case type lines. Um, this case itself kind of mimics the original Apple case with the, uh, the slight border around the edges of the iPad, as you can see right here. And right there, right off the bat, you can see the magnetic uh, deal working on the case, the smart cover feature. But anyway, it's got this small border that goes around the sides, kind of giving you a, a, a corner protection on the uh, iPad. So as you can see, it looks very sharp in the case, in the uh, case here, and it's easy to install. You just slide the iPad in that way, and there's a little flap you tuck under right here in the, in the corner here. Uh, it tucks in right under there. It's got a nice, nice, nice flat... Uh, curvature to it so as you can see it doesn't add much bulk at all it's very very nice in regards to that and um, they I really it's kind of hard to point out point this out without seeing it but as you can see this is a soft felt right here but the the border of the leather actually goes up and over it a little bit here around the edges and I really like that it gives it a very good sense of you know high quality that if you were to drop your iPad, you know, and obviously if you hit any of these corners, it's not going to affect your iPad whatsoever. This this adds a, you know, a, a layer of protection that's probably not in most cases, and uh, I really appreciate it. Um, here, it, like I said, here it is. See, it doesn't add much bulk at all, but it adds a very very nice style to it that I really like. And um, this is the flap for doing the uh, typing position. And uh, it actually lays down near immediately. It doesn't stay, stay up like you would think. Um, you can't see the iPad there, but um, the case is so tight that nothing's going to get in there. I, I, I was, you know, I'll be honest. I mean, I'm an iPad, you know, fanatic. Um, I was worried stuff would get in there, but after using it for multiple days and just kind of going, all right, let's give this a try, like a real try, um, nothing gets in there whatsoever. So I'm... Um, I'm confident in saying do not worry about this flap. Actually, it's really, really nice because your iPad will actually lay flat on any type of table. <laughs> Go figure when all the other type cases that have that mounting thing right, generally right here, so the flap, or right here, so the flap can uh, tuck under it. Um, that makes it wobble on a table. So it's actually really nice to be able to lay this flat on a table. Um, all the cutouts are nice. So you got the speaker grill here and all the cutouts for that, and your speaker and rocker, and see, everything's perfect. Everything's lined up nicely. So, um, over, I, I'm really, really enjoying this case, and I'm using it a lot now, and it's becoming one of my favorite cases. I just like the look of it. It's unique. It's not your standard issue, black leather case, yada, yada. It's got kind of a cool looking uh, decal here, and uh, the, the felt in this is insanely, insanely soft. It almost feels like a true microfiber, not just, you know, kind of a stereotypical soft liner. <laughs> but um, it is becoming truly one of my favorite cases for the iPad, too. It just took a little bit of warming up for me to get used to this, uh, the rear flap here. In which case, here, I'll go ahead and pull this out of the shot a little bit. And uh, so you can see what the typing position looks like. You know, just like the first iPad case. And uh, let's see, I can show you what it looks like in the back. That's how it tucks in. And of course, you got a standing position like this. But yeah, I am really liking this case. You know, it took a little bit of getting used to, but um, I'm really liking it. It's actually one of my favorites now. So I'll include info on purchasing down below. But uh, this is the Chinao Wheat case, and I give it a big two thumbs up now. Thank you very much, everybody, and have a good one.